Hey what's up guys, welcome to a new video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the top 5 CDI tweaks that were released during the week. So the theme that is showing right now is called Ellis Lyra and it is a very cool lock screen theme. It's very clean and the clock temperature and slider are at the bottom of the background and you can actually change the wallpaper as well so that's pretty awesome. So I hope you guys like the theme and without any further ado let's go ahead and get started. Alright guys, so the first CDI tweak is going to be activate link from the Big Boss repo. When we head into the settings of the tweak, you can see that I have three links to different websites and so what this tweak will basically allow you to do is access any of these links anywhere by using an activator gesture. So when I hold on to my status bar, for example here, I can go into jailbreaknation.com or if I double tap it, it takes me to the Apple website. So it's pretty convenient if you have a link that you use all the time. Now there are going to be working just in Safari, so no Chrome or any other browser. Next up, we have a tweak called LiveWire Pro. Now you guys may be familiar with LiveWire, which only has one unlock effect for the lock screen. And so what LiveWire Pro will allow you to do is have several more animations that you can choose from. And you can see some examples here. You can also change the speed of the animation so you can make it slower or faster. My favorite effect is the vault, which is actually the one that comes by default. And it is the one that simulates a door opening, which looks pretty cool. But I also like Fade Out. Next in our list is going to be Power Music Mini Player. Now this is going to allow your iPod or iPhone to play any song straight from your lock screen or your notification center and you will have to enable either one or both of these in the settings but as you can see there is now a small music icon on the lock screen and when I tap it I can now easily access any album or song and you can take advantage of the music controls that are already on the lock screen to have your own mini player every time you need it. The next CD tweak we're going to be taking a look at is Switcher Animation. With this tweak you'll now be able to basically make the transition between multitasking apps a lot better by setting this cool fading animation. Now the tweak will only work with apps that are already in the multitasking mode, otherwise it's not going to work and it's going to have the usual flip transition. That's why the tweak is called Switcher Animation. And finally guys, the last package for today's episode is Swipe Shift Carrot. Now this is actually an old school tweak and some of you guys may recognize it. But basically when I type something in notes here, you can see that I have a lot of mistakes on the word subscribe. And typically to move to a certain spot on that word, I would have to use a magnifying glass by holding onto the screen and then move it, which frankly is absolutely terrible. But now I can simply swipe anywhere on the screen to move from letter to letter. Well guys, if you like the lock screen, stay tuned. I have a video coming up this week on three awesome themes. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. As always, subscribe for more videos like this one. And have yourself a nice day.